Like right now? <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. It's like a Ron Burgundy. Yeah, I thought you were gonna ask a question. Take this class. It's, it was so helpful. Hi, my name is Andres Esquivel. I'm from Costa Rica. My name is Brian Jimenez. I come from North Hollywood, California. My name is Robert Masucci. I'm almost 30 and I'm from Pasadena. My name is Rod Raimundo. I'm from Pasadena. My name is Mark Hassan. I've been going to PCC for the past two years. I started doing concept art while well, taking classes like a year and a half ago. My art age is roughly a year, year and a half. It's my first time taking a real art class. <laughs> I've been pursuing art for about two to three years. I've been studying art seriously for about five years now. DC1 is like a foundation class for me. And I expected like to learn how to light things, how to use good color, and uh, learn about composition. My color and my rendering skills are not that great, so I decided to take a digital painting class. I haven't really been comfortable in painting and light. I've had some traditional experience, so I was trying to figure out a way to blend the both. I was really bad at color. Like black and white paintings I can more or less do, sketching I can more or less do. It's just getting a color painting that isn't psychedelic looking. I had none of that fundamental background. I wanted to develop more of my color skills. The stuff that was being taught is also stuff that I can use in the future. I really like the plein air exercises a lot. It's like, I really look forward to doing that more. Film composition. Film studies. It was fun, like doing little thumbnails and figuring out what you need to light and what it stays in the dark. A lot of fun and just you have to like just push through it to get through all the silhouettes. The homework where we do an environment piece but it's as a daytime piece and a nighttime piece and you know just seeing how the lighting and the colors would change for the same exact subject. Plain air painting. You know it was my first time ever like digitally painting outside. I mean I wasn't strong at it but it was my favorite one. Color and color palettes, absolutely. The limited palette actually helped a lot. The limited palette is really helpful. Limiting my color palette, I, I think, was the most useful. Limited color palette, that's something that I'd never tried, I'd never thought of before. And oddly enough, that actually ended up being probably one of the most useful tools that I've learned. I was in the same exact position. Should I take this class? Or should I not take this class? Take this class. It's, it was so helpful, especially if you're struggling with like color. It, it really helped me quite a bit. You need to learn about how light works and how to render things, and how to add color to your paintings. This is definitely the class you have to take. I think DC1 is like a linchpin for the other classes. It's almost like a traditional like art class. I think if you put in the time, it's, it's going to be really useful for painting. I am planning on taking all the brainstorm classes. Brainstorm, brainstorm design, design, solve, learn. learn.